and welcome to another DS3 video. So we're gonna do the phantom scaling glitch. So basically what you gotta do, it's all set up. Put down your white sign, as soon as it pops up put it down again, like that. Put in your password, in this case it's going to be 1010. And wait for your friend to summon you. Now look at my AR, 454, 324, 224. If we do this right, my damage should not be scaled, and I should have my full unembered health, which I forgot to check when I was doing invasions to check. I really failed on that part, but anyway. So I put my down my sign, uh, Becker, the guy who worked with it last time, uh, is made another character, so just waiting on him to summon me at this point. Also, got a dagger. This is uh, my uh, soul level. This is that one guy. That, that's, uh, yeah. I finally finished him, changed up the armor a bit. No longer doing laps, as you probably could have guessed. More cool or cooler armor, I suppose. Ah, look. He's already summoning me. On a soul level, guessing he went with Thief again. We'll have to see what armor he has. Thief is 9, Knight is uh, 10, I believe. Warrior is 9, the Mercenary is 9. What do you go with? Deprived. Oh, so he's still level 1, and see, still have all my damage. Yeah, this worked good. Um, let's see if he wants to kill for it. Alright, let's go. Man, we really should use voice chat, but, uh... Okay, he has it. Let me just clear out these enemies. Actually, do I one-shot people with my dagger? I do. Cool. This will waste a lot less stamina. So, yeah. Got really good at farming the these guys because I had to farm them for souls um, to level this guy up some more, and that was with the wing knight thing. Nice. So I think this one comes out faster. Just gonna grab the bonfire, I'm gonna go down here and clear out these guys. Where are you? Here you are. Nice. Now, if you gank with this, um... Oh god, that's right. New York. Um, if you gank with this, I will not be happy with you. But, you know, if you want to help a guy who's not very good at the game, Go right ahead. Um, Black Knight Shield. I basically switched this up a bit. Oh, that's right. Voice time. There we go. And obviously, as you can tell, I'm wearing the Entry Dark Ring. Play some more. Okay. We'll probably kill Dancer as well. Because, uh, just to show you how good this is. Where are you? Here you are.
<laughs> it is fun doing this though. Whoop, whoop, there's, there we go. But uh, you take no damage pretty much. So I'm going to absolutely melt oh god, lost ignite. Going to absolutely melt Vort. Um Heh. <laughs> as soon as the cutscene starts, of course. So I think I'll be put back to neutral. Let's see. Oh. Lost ignite just disappeared. Cool. Oh, the uh Oh god. Come on. Yeah, so, you know, what should you expect from your other normal Vort fight, right? He's still alive. Okay. And that, my friends, is how you delete the Vort. So, uh, he's so level one. Oop. Okay. Alright, horse the bonfire. We are going to kill Dancer. So, let's swing on over to her bonfire. You have to uh, remember when you do this between bosses, you have to delete your password, which I'm going to do. I'm going to show you how. I mean, you should know how, but you know. Um, so basically, you put down a white sign, then as soon as it pops back up, or you can put it down again, put it down again. Then you can put in your password, and uh, should be good to go. Very, uh, very good for helping low-level people. And I actually recorded one where I thought the guy got me, but, uh, he ended up beating the boss on his own. Crystal Sage. But, yeah. And that's the one I was going to use. But thankfully, Becker was here. So you put it down. As soon as it goes white, put it down again. Password. It's one. Zero. On zero. Ta da! Oops. Thought that was my dagger. <laughs> Still no backstab, but hey. Okay. Yeah, so that's. It's uh, really easy to use. Like, really easy. I actually joined the Souls Glitch Court asking about it, and they didn't have a video for it, so. That's where I made my first video, and my second, and this will be the third, and I have a fourth already recorded. I really like this glitch, if you haven't, couldn't tell. Also, my beautiful face. Oops. <laughs> I'll be releasing a video here sometime saying uh, a bit about my completed builds like an intro to each build but this one will be the first because this one is by far my favorite this is what my series started at this is what my series will hopefully not end because that would be bad that means that Dark Souls would be truly be dead but you know yeah now we're just waiting for it or not Vort, uh, Becker. Let's go kill the other Lothic Knight while we're waiting. So yeah, if we're doing Dancer. Oh yeah, that's right, he has to trigger the Dancer fight first. There we go, whoa! Come on, come down. Okay. Just a uh, quick step away here. 
made a couple builds on Soul Planter that I don't actually intend on making. I only ha I have six four slots available. So one's going to be an 802. One's probably going to be like a soul level 300. Um, because apparently you get a lot of invasions there. Oh, and he's dead. Nope, he's not. Okay, cool. Backer, come on, don't die. God damn it. Looks like we're gonna be doing this again. With soul level one and just absolutely melting the answer. Anything like that you did. Cool. What did you drop? Tiny chart. Don't need that, but uh, just do this. Down. Down. Uh, one, zero, one, zero. Let's try this again. I'm going to uh, inform him to not die. The dancer hits hard, he says. Well, he certainly. Er, sh this guy's already dead. She certainly does. Dark Sword is actually pretty long. Like, look at this. It's, uh. I don't think it's longer than a Lothric Knight Straight Sword, but it's long. Also, for my Dark Belt, I'm doing Goddards. Doing Goddard's Claymore and my hand axe, but it's going to be a powerful build. It's for dueling, for ganking, not so much invasions because can't really. It's not set up for that. It's set up for like one person combat. So this is kind of cool. Look, kind of looks like the Lothic Knight cape, or the beginnings of it, where. Here's a lot of night. Um, can you, uh, rotate you? Clip you around? Ragdoll, please work for me. Damn it. Work. <sighs> Maybe this guy fell the right way? Never mind. Never mind. And he got killed by the law. Ah, uh, boy. But yeah, soul level one is uh, tough for dancer, especially when you have an overall phantom boosting its health. I mean, a scaled down phantom. I mean, a not scaled down phantom that's boosting its health. Also, what are these statues? Do I have binoculars? Don't think I do. No. I have a lot of souls to spend. Oh well. Okay. And now we wait for Becker. Okay, we're moving down to Vort, I suppose. He's having trouble with the Lothic Knights. I don't blame him. They're pretty tough. Whoops. Delete there. Entering the inputs late. Let me just... Noon. Noon. Zero. Okay, now to my 
message that the sign is down. He's struggling. <sighs> of course he Am I taking the stairs two stairs at a time? Let's say one, two. I am. Huh. Even when I'm walking slowly, edge walking. Okay, well, he doesn't see it. So let's try this again. I put the password in, right? Might not have. Okay, and now we wait for him to see it. Okay, he sees it. Yeah, it's sometimes weird. You should wait like a minute until they actually see it. It's it's weird, but sometimes it takes longer. Sometimes it's right away. But yeah, that's uh, it's a little bit a little confusing. Let's hope he doesn't die this time. I Becker, I really don't need your help. You can calm down, just sit in the back and don't die. God damn it, Becker. Uh. 